What is the connection between Rudolf Steiner and John Paul II? As part of the Anthroposophical Theater Group in Poland, Karl Wojtyla was working with the art of speech and Rudolf Steiner's mystery dramas. Here he is with the book, Meditation on the Tarot sitting on his desk. Valentin Tomberg, another fan of Steiner, wrote the book Meditations on the Tarot, which was forwarded by Cardinal Hans Urs von Balthasar. What is the connection between John Paul II and the impostor Lucy? Here are the letters and belongings displayed by the nuns of Coimbra, Portugal after the death of the impostor Lucy. Oh look, is this an oversight or did they display these yin-yang occult balls on purpose? Why would they do this? Is it to sully the reputation of the real sister Lucia? The answer to the above question is that Steiner, John Paul II and the impostor Lucy all dabbled in the occult. Does Bertoni and the Vatican want people to believe that the messenger of Fatima, Lucia dos Santos, was a practitioner of the occult? Bertoni claims to have been the first person into the cell of Lucy II. Did he not see these yin yang balls? The amazing discovery by Sister Lucy Truth of video footage, showing occult yin-yang balls amidst the belongings of the woman that we now know was an imposter Sister Lucy, presents us with further avenues of investigation into the life and activities of the woman, who stole the persona of Sister Lucy dos Santos, the messenger of Our Lady of Fatima. That the Carmelites of Coimbra and the Vatican handlers of the fake persona of the imposter Sister Lucy, would not feel any kind of embarrassment presenting to the world evidence potentially linking Sister Lucy to occult practice, is indicative of where we are in the history of the Catholic Church. The religious indifferentism of the post-enlightenment period has been transformed into a willing cooperation in the religious tradition of pagan and occult practitioners. As Sister Lucy Truth has insisted, since professional reports clearly indicated that there had been a substitution and an imposture, the new Sister Lucy was in perfect accord with the new Church of the New Order. Just as John Paul II can have a book about tarot cards on his desk, so too, fake Sister Lucy has no problem keeping these superstitious trinkets with her, amidst her belongings. Help us find the ones who did this. Support us at Sister Lucy Truth slash donate. Here is the footage where the yin yang occult balls were shown. Humildade e a fidelidade à missão confiada. Esses arquivos certamente vão revelar traços surpreendentes da Carmelita, que vão além da vidente de Fátima. Uma pessoa muito dinâmica, muito humilde, muito simples, que, que estava sempre presente.